Pair and polyfluoroalkyl substances, or PFAS, are a group of thousands of synthetic chemicals. And they are everywhere. From rain jackets to pizza boxes, to guitar strings, waterproof makeup, and even dental floss. PFAS are also used to produce technologies that are key for the green and digital transitions, such as semiconductors, electric car batteries, and even wind turbines. They are highly resistant and very good at repelling water, grease, and oil. But what makes them so useful also makes them potentially harmful. They are called forever chemicals because they don't naturally break down in the environment. Today, they can be found in water, soil, animal feed, and even in our blood. Research conducted across nine European countries found PFAS in the blood of teenagers in every single country studied. Scientific studies have linked PFAS to cancer, cardiovascular and thyroid diseases, infertility, and immune system disorders. Most technologies for PFAS treatment used today only serve to remove them from water and they are expensive. Currently, only a few PFAS are banned in the European Union, but this could change. In 2023, five European countries proposed restricting PFAS on their reach the European Union's chemical regulation. The European Chemicals Agency is now evaluating the proposal. It will then share its opinions with the European Commission, which, together with member states, will decide on the restriction.